Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to share the survey as part of the grocery store inventory template using ArcGIS Hub. The survey is essential to this template because it is how you will generate data to configure lo local maps and reports about product availability and store conditions in your community. To share the survey, open your site in edit mode and click the second drop down menu. Choose content library. And here's where you will find all of the items that were generated when you activated the template. This includes the survey as well as map reports. The survey is called the grocery store reporter COVID-19. It's listed as an app. Click to open it. And in survey edit mode, you can add or remove questions, modify the look and feel. You can even change the background color under appearance. Since we want to adjust the sharing settings, I'm going to click the survey drop down menu and look for the option to collaborate. If you don't see this option and you only see the option to design, that's okay. It means that your survey hasn't been fully published yet. And you can take care of that by going to the bottom of your screen here, in the bottom right corner, click publish, click publish again. And this creates two feature services, one called results and one called inputs. And this is how uh, data from your survey will be captured. And you will use these uh, services when configuring your map reports. So now that you technically have something to share, go to the drop down menu again, click on collaborate. And on the submitter tab, ensure that the checkbox for everyone is clicked for who can submit to the survey. This means that anyone without an account can take the survey. Make sure that add and update records is checked for the question, what can submitters do? Allow multiple submissions for the survey. And of course, the survey needs to be open to accept responses. So ensure that that is checked. Click Save. Once that's finished, move on to the Viewer tab. And here are the settings for who can view the responses that other people have submitted. Not actually who can view the survey, but who can view those responses. So if you're having issues uh, with data appearing on your maps, um, come to this page. You may need to adjust some of these sharing settings. So for who can view results of the survey, make sure that that is everyone. Another important one for what data can viewers see, make sure that that is set to all records in the survey. This means that um, people can see all survey responses. Otherwise, if only their own, their own submitted records was, was selected, that would mean that you know, they would only see the, the responses that they themselves have added. And of course, that's not very helpful. So click on Save. After those changes are saved, I'm going to go back to Design. I'm going to publish the survey again, just to ensure that all of those changes are applied correctly. Click Publish. And once that is finished, go back to your initiative site by clicking on this more button, choose your site. Now I want to make sure that everything is functioning from the perspective um, of my audience, which is an anonymous visitor. So I've made sure that my site's visibility is set to public. I'm going to save the site and then click view. And since people can take the survey without an account, I'm going to sign out. Scroll down to the survey and click to open it. Looks like everything is functioning as expected. If you have any questions about this workflow, please leave them in the comments. And thank you for watching.